You know, as a child, um, I have seen a car accident when I was very young, and uh, I have seen uh, an ambulance trying to rescue people. And that was the moment where I realized mm. that's something where you can help other people and helping them to cure. I think that was the key moment where I realized that becoming a doctor is what I want to be. You see the tears in the eyes of the patients because they are happy that after a long time they conceived and they have their child. Um, that gives you a lot of satisfaction that you helped people to reach what they were looking for. The key highlight of the career was a couple who tried for more than 20 years to conceive and um, I told them to stop because it was, I, I don't want to say impossible, but it was really almost impossible. After having, I don't know how many treatments around the world, I say around the world, I mean in the US, in Europe, uh, in Asia, everywhere. Um, and after more than 20 years, they conceived. I think that was the highlight. And uh, these are things you don't see every day, but it happens. But that was, if you ask me in, in these 20 years or so, I think that was the highlight. So I would like to, to drive out with a car in the desert with some nice music if the weather is not too hot. Yes, actually there are two, not one, because initially when I started medicine, I did not want to become gynecologist. So I wanted to become a surgeon. So the idea was to go for surgery. Um, but in, in Belgium, you have a rotation system where you rotate through different uh, specialties. And uh, I came in touch with, uh, with one of the professors of gynecology. His name was Professor Jean-Jacques Ami, a very interesting person. And I was impressed by him as a person, because if you would have told me that I said, medicine, you're going to become a gynecologist, I would have said, are you crazy, me, gynecologist? No. But that person, he traveled around the world, he worked in Africa, and he had all these nice stories. And, you know, starting gynecology rotation, I saw gynecology is not only taking a pap smear, it's a very wide range of medicine, because obviously you can have surgeries, a lot of endoscopic surgeries, um, you can have endocrinology, it's like an internal medicine. You have radiology because you do a lot of scans. So I have seen that it's really a wide range of medicine. It's everything in gynecology and you can subspecialize in what you want to do. And this is why I choose to become a gynecologist because of that particular person. And the second person was when I was doing my subspecialty. His name is Professor Paul Dufruy. Um, he was so passionate about what he was doing and he, something very special about him was he could manage and get the best out of people around him. And that's what I've learned from him. And these two people had a major impact uh, on, on me.